So Greg, two very good camps here for this lady C-Class Muay Thai. Brian Terrell, Luc Borai, Southampton. Charlie Lowe, Wasmuff in Muay Thai. Yeah, both both great camps. I actually know Charlie personally, I went to school with her. <laughs> a really nice girl, very good technical fighter. Both girls not really game, both both come from good camps, it's gonna be a good fight. Yes, big stage for them, C-class fight, learning their trade. And at the moment, very even. Yeah, definitely. Both landing pretty much the same work on the inside. And again, a very experienced Muay Thai ref in the ring as well. So as long as they're working in that clinch, he'll be happy with it. Yeah, them. definitely, yeah. Nice knee there from Lowe. Yes, as we saw earlier, both girls happy to work in the clinch. You get the feeling that Lowe wants to force the pace. Yeah. But Terrell's good at closing that gap, getting into the clinch and making it very difficult for her. Yeah, she's, she's doing well smothering her shots. And there's some subtle little knees to the thigh of Lowe from Terrell. Yeah, they, they, they don't look like much, but they take their time. They're not nice. The fight goes on to fill those. Now, a nice little knee attempt on the inside from Lowe. But as I said, there's some subtlety to Terrell's work that I like there. Yeah. Little inside kick, little knees to the thighs. Yeah. It's a good technical bout so yeah, far, right? It's very even. Well, very good, even opening round there. Yeah, it's hard to call that one. So round two or three, and it's a very close fight so far. Charlie Lowe really wants to be the aggressor, but Brian Itrell fights well on the counter, so it's a lovely match, isn't it? Yeah, it's very, very well evenly matched, great matchmaking from, from the matchmakers. Beautiful, beautiful work on the inside as well. Great little knees to the thighs. Got some good knees as well from Lowe. Well, I think what Terrell's done is she's picked up how good Lowe is on the outside. Yeah, and tried to negate that. Yeah, definitely. He's got very strong, strong hands. He's landed some good right hands. Terrell doing fantastic for tight ends of the clinch and working well when she's in there. Good, good matchup. Yeah, for me, the one that wins this fight is the one that's able to dictate with their tactics. Yeah, definitely. I, I, I think it might just it'll take one. One little technique, one little swift move from either fighter to really make his fight turn on its head. But at the moment, very eagle, evenly matched. Again, strong hands from Lowe. Terrell did a great job in tying her up. But in that last exchange, Lowe did get through with a very good left knee and another. And, a, and again, there's a couple of very good knees in that exchange from Lowe. And again, she's really starting to throw a lot more knees now. She's getting some good success. A slightly taller fighter. Like slightly longer legs. It's a good tactic from Lowe. And if she can get the knee off early enough. Nice left hook from Lowe to a right body shot and some good knees as well. Well, if she, she gets the knee off early enough, it stops the good clinch work of Terrell as yeah, well. Yeah, definitely. Really good match, really close match. Beautiful left knee again. If I was low, I'd be looking to, to get the half tie clinch and be looking to right, that, throw that right uppercut on the inside as well. There's slightly more variety from Terrell's work, but I felt a very good round from both women, and I might, with those knees, just a bump below in that. I would have just edged her for that second round. So, third and final round, and Greg, we've got this very close and very evenly matched. Yeah, is it the first round, I, it's so close. It's, it's, too, it's too much in it to I think it's pretty draw. The second round, you can argue that Lowe landed some slightly better knees. I think she just picked the round up. It's still, it's still anyone's fight in my eyes. Well, I think what's happened is both corners have told them how close it is because both girls have really stepped up. Yeah. This round. You can see from the opening seconds, 
they've really upped the pace again. Yeah, definitely. And do you know what? Both corners could be right. It's had the judges see it, not us in the goal. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Either one of these ladies could be winning this yeah, fight, and that's third right. round could be essential. I think it is that close. I think this is the last, this is the round that takes us in So, low once again, forcing the pace, but Terrell good on the counter, yeah. and both girls very evenly matched in the clinch. It's so close in the clinch, so I think they're as good as each other. It's, it's so, so close, I'm glad I'm not a judge for this one. No, sometimes it really is tough. And until you look with hindsight at the video and study it, I got a feeling that whichever girl doesn't get this result yeah. will feel aggrieved. Yeah, definitely. I still think Lowe is doing slightly more oh, good, good head kick attempt there from the crowd. But I think on the outside, Lowe's getting slightly better with the work, but it's, it's very marginal. But also in traditional Thai fashion, they've saved the best till last. The best round is this third. They've both Lovely. really gone all out. That was a good push to left knee from Lowe there. And again, that left knee is really working well for him. He needs to throw, throw some hands here. Again. Well, you saw there, Terrell is the one that initiates the clinch. He doesn't want to work on the outside, but this is close, Greg.